So this is one of the first modern uh, production plants in Ecuador. We run water from one of the streams that comes down from one of the local towns. This runs in a water treatment plant, what we call grey water, runs through the plant and basically comes out pure water which we use into the plant. Right here is our fine ore stockpile. Wheel. This is where all the, uh, the gold that we've mined in the rock gets uh, put here, ready to be going through the first crusher. So from there it goes through the uh, jaw crusher, then it goes through a cone crusher, a screening plant. The fines from that, which are generally just over half inch, then goes into our fine ore bin. Under our fine ore bin, we have uh, feeders. Those feeders feed up a belt and into the ball mill. Now in the ball mill, they take the uh, grind down to something like talcum powder and that makes it easier to extract the gold and silver and metals that we have in the ore. From there it goes to the tanks and these, in these tanks we use uh, lime and cyanide with the water which is all mixed with the slurry. So we, we come into a, a pulp which is about 40% uh, solids and of course in these tanks we have mixers and the pulp mixes around. Then we run into the carbon tanks. In these tanks we have carbon and the gold gets extracted from the liquid into carbon. From the carbon we take it into our stripping plant. We have big long columns in which we put the carbon in and we use hot water, once again cyanide. We use a very alkaline salinity to um, extract the gold. And we also use a uh, ethanol process as well. So from there we extract the gold onto steel plating. We electroplate it just like you would a watch. Then we extract the gold off the steel plating and we process it ready for pouring into a furnace and we put that in with fluxes and then we pour that into a bar of gold. And from the bar of gold we take our gold and present it to Canada and sell it here. Thank you.